Spain's transition team is pushing ahead on a key campaign pledge, slashing smartphone bills. Unsurprisingly, the administration's plans are facing some pushback from the country's telecom giants. Shin Semin reports. The president's policy advisory committee says it'll encourage local telecom service providers to give bigger discounts for mobile phone bills. It was a campaign promise made by the president himself when he said he would scrap the initial subscription fee of a little under 10 U.S. dollars. That would mean an extra 5 percent off the basic plan, which could begin as early as September. Citizens will have their monthly telecom discounts raised from the current 20 percent to 25 percent. And an additional cut of nine U.S. dollars from the fees of the elderly citizens and low-income mobile carriers during the latter half of the year. In total, it's expected the plan could save people about 4.6 trillion won, or over 4 billion U.S. dollars, in mobile fees a year. Telecom costs have long been felt to be a major burden, with civic groups and lawmakers calling on the telecom providers to lower them. But this latest measure from the Policy Advisory Committee is expected to face a strong backlash from the big mobile carriers such as SK Telecom, KT Corporation and LGU Plus, which claim their profitability would be seriously hurt along with their future investment. Following the announcement of the measures, they've already sought legal advice from one of the country's largest law firms, Kim and Tang. The advisory committee also hinted at further discussions about abolishing the basic telecommunication fees in the coming weeks. Shin Zemin, Arirang News.